Now, would you believe me if I told you within five minutes walk from here, in this very river here, we've got people catching New Zealand's most sought after delicacy. Now, you wouldn't believe that, would you? But trust me, come for a walk and I'll show you. G'day guys, today I'm in the beautiful heart of Christchurch City, South Island, New Zealand and we're next to the Avon River, right in the heart of the town as you can see behind me, beautiful looking in the central city here today guys today guys we're going to be catching seafood in the Avon River that cost up to $150 a kilo, you don't believe me do you? but trust me, Pete's got it all sorted out anyway guys, same as usual, if you like my videos, subscribe, drop me a like, drop me a comment come say good day in the comments below and let's go for a little walk righty oh my friends just follow me around here has pete got some stuff to show you today yeah oh here we go guys take a bit of a shortcut so my friends oh, i've wandered from town just around the corner to the red zone of christchurch now here's the red zone and it's still the red zone see the beautiful avon river here and if we look across there guys, you see all those fields across there? That used to be intense housing over there, that used to be city suburbs. And now look at it, it is absolutely nothing there apart from greenery. You wouldn't think this was right in the middle of the CBD, would you? But today we're talking about white baiting. Now white baiting on the Avon River, right in central Christchurch, you wouldn't believe it, would you? Have a look across there guys, we've got some kids with their white bait net and a shopping trolley. Everyone's into white baiting here, isn't that awesome? Is that cool or is that cool? Give the kids something to do on the school holidays as well. Now guys, white bait goes for anywhere around $120, $150 a kilo at the moment. So it's like swimming gold my friends, swimming gold. So if we have a look on the other side of the river there guys, we've got someone set up a camp over there with their white bait gear. So guys, we've got a man fishing down here. Is it alright if we have a look at your white bait, mate? Yeah, yeah, there's a wee bit there, mate. No worries, cheers. Just leave it behind. <laughs> Just leave it behind, you reckon? Look at this, guys. Fresh white bait. Look at it. So what do you do? Do you gut the things or what? No, no, no. You just eat them with a bit of an egg, crack an egg. Tomato sauce? No, definitely not. <laughs> I said that to somebody else and I, I only put tomato sauce in mine and they thought I was a bit strange. Look at that guys. Fresh New Zealand white bait. Caught in the Avon. Isn't that cool? Look at this guys. See they're almost see-through. I believe they're about a bloody 150 bucks a kilo or something mate. Oh yeah, what about... Um, white bait patties in fish and chip shops can well, you get them i don't know i suppose they're about eight dollars each whoa <laughs> look at that fresh white bait isn't that cool that's really really cool there we've got white bait nets and trees so that's pretty amazing eh maybe they're catching butterflies don't think there'd be much of a profit in butterflies though so if we cross the new footbridge across the avon river there we've got some more white baiters down that side there guys so let's go and see if someone down there will have a yarn with us. How you going, buddy? Yeah, Ca mate. Catch anything? Uh, a little bit. Cool. Yeah, yeah, you want to have a look? Yeah, why not? Yeah, look. One scoop. Probably half a pound. Oh, is that cool or is that cool? What, oh, well. What would you pay for that in the restaurant? Uh, probably 20 bucks or so. Maybe more. 30, 40. Yeah, but how long did it take you to get it? Uh, probably first... 20 minutes 20 minutes yeah and then nothing since That's holy crap ago. oh well i was going to say i'm in the wrong game guys but <laughs> he's waiting here for an hour and a half it's like gold at the moment yeah it is what, 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 what's it worth like probably 40 bucks a pound 40 bucks a pound yeah. so what's a two and a half pound so what's it about 110 something, something 110 like a kilo yeah yeah it's awesome mate and how the how the does it work mate you oh, just you use your scoop net yeah, like that yeah. see you see it coming over your boards Oh yeah, boards there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then, so they're white, obviously. Obviously, they're white, Pete. You yeah, idiot. Yeah. And the and then, fish swim uh, over the top, and you can see the reflection. You see of that, them right? coming. You get you put your net in, and then you just 
slowly walk, work your way forward. Cool, mate. That's Not too much because they'll dub come forward anyway. That's awesome. What's the best day you've ever had? Uh, over there, nine pound one nine, day. Nine, did it take still, you? Still pitiful. Really? Yeah, yeah. What's a, what's a good There's day? There's guys then? around there getting 40 odd pounds a day. My okay. mess is not that good, mate, but let me think about that. One year they got wow. a ton. They got a ton, 30 grand's worth. Wow, we. No wonder they call it white gold, mate. Yeah, that's. Do the you one. like the taste of it, though? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Like there? Yeah. Eggs, eggs, and. Yeah. I was, I, was freaking, I was telling a freaking guy down there before that I put tomato sauce on mine. Oh. <laughs> he said, you're not even a New Zealander. <laughs> no, this is a bit of salt, just a light spring of salt and fresh bread. Awesome, mate, awesome. Nice, nice fresh bread. I'm Pete, by the way. I'm Brian. How are you, Brian? With a Y. <laughs> Brian with a Y. Yeah. That's awesome, mate. Cool. Hey, thanks for showing us. That's all good, mate. So we're still following the Avon round. Almost right back into town, and we've got another man here, white man. Here you go, mate. Yeah, not bad. Cool. You had any luck today? Yeah, no, I'm getting a good feed. Yeah. Getting a good feed? Yeah, probably about a pound, about and a half. Wow, cool. Well, how long did it take you to get that? Uh, and you takes me about an hour. Really? Yeah, about an hour. Is it is it running or? Yeah, well, sometimes it's running, and other times it doesn't run. All right. Yep. And it all depends on what's coming up the river. Yeah. And um, if there's nobody down there, you get a lot of bait coming up here uh, on the outgoing. Oh, on the outgoing tide, yep. Yeah, yep. A lot of the bait when they come up, they go out to the middle. All right, and you can't get them because you. No, no. But the idea is, is to pick up a stone and you slide the stone out and yeah. it brings the bait in. Oh, so it scares them into the yeah, bank. It scares them into the bank, yeah. Cool. And then how much would you get per scoop? Well, um, it's all depends. Sometimes you can get about. Two, about three pounds. Really? Yeah. What's the best day you've ever had, mate? Well, uh, sometimes I can get up to about ten pounds. Wow, that's good, eh? Yeah. It's awesome. I don't even know how you can see the bait in that water. It's a bit murky. Yeah. Well, I got uh, glasses, uh, glasses, uh, proper glasses for seeing into the water. Oh, so you can actually get I glasses can... to see in the water? Yeah. Yeah. I can, I can pick the bait up. Oh wow, that's awesome, mate. Yeah. So we've got those those lines in the water there that we can see. You yeah. use that for the bait to run over the top, so you can see the bait. Is that right? Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah, um, sometimes uh, I usually have about five in. Yeah. And I usually put, you know, spread them out. Yeah. And I usually look at the first one, and that tells me how much bait's coming in, uh, up the river. Wow, cool. But isn't that net really, really heavy? No. 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 Awesome. So do you come down every day? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't come here. My mate comes here. Uh, yeah. I only just come here today because he wasn't here. Cool. It's a nice day out too when the sun's shining, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. I like it. Uh, uh, even when they, the light, it, it shines on, on, onto the, uh, onto the, my spotter. Yep. And I can actually see them clear. Yeah, oh, cool. It's really good. And we're also close to the city, eh? Yeah. Yeah, it's really good. Have you caught some white bait today? Yep. Can yep. we have a look? Yep. Cool. Thank you. Wow. Oh, look at that, guys. More fresh white bait. Isn't that awesome? Wow. So you get a good feed out of that? Yep. Wow, that's pretty cool, eh? Yep. And you keep them alive until you take yep. them home, or? Yep. Yep. That's cool, eh? Look at that, guys. Jumping white bait. That's awesome. <laughs> and man's putting his net in there now. Have you got some more on the bottom there? Yep. Oh, really? Yep. Oh, wow. Look at that, guys. Hey, that is really, really awesome. So you've got a... That's really clever. You've got a jar on the bottom of that. Yeah. With holes in it. Yeah. I was the only one that invented that. That is really cool. So it's got holes in it, lets the water out. You take yep. the screw top off and you put your white bait in the, in yeah, the straight big in bucket. There. Yeah, and then you just... Put the screw back up and then put it straight back into the water. Well, then that's smart, my friend. That is smart. Yep. Cool. So you just wait now until you see another shoal. Yep. And then yep. you. Wow, yep. that's really, really awesome. Can you see something? No, no. I just got to get it back in the water. All right. They, they comes over. Yep. And they get frightened over. They be start shaking your neck. Oh, I see. That scares them away. It scares them away. Up. No good? No, nah, my net. 
got hooked up on the... Oh, that's a shame. That's a good shoal, too. Yeah, I didn't even see it, mate. Right up here. Yeah, well, I didn't see them at all. <laughs> I've been no good a white bait fisherman. Uh, I'd sit here and watch them all go past. <laughs> yeah, I've got a, a sit net stand about that high. Yeah. And about that wide. Yeah. Or a bit wider. And I can uh, put it in up against the bait and the bait just from straight into it. Wow, that's cool. Eh? So, so how come you're using a scoop today then? Well, I just thought I'd bring the scoop down because I eat, uh, I eat you like Scooping. Yep. Um, but a lot of the time the bait will go round the round the set net. Oh, cool. That's really awesome. Hey, thanks for explaining that to me. Yeah. That's, uh, that's really really awesome. But those nets they're using down there, those cross nets. Yeah. The bait. Um, a lot of the, the these people they don't know. Uh, you especially uh, take it out about a couple of inches out. Yeah. And that lets a flow. Yeah. Through the river, through it, and on both sides, and the bait will swim up against the current. All right. Just go straight into your net. Oh, so that's a secret sauce, really, is it? Yeah. Wow. A lot of them they block the block the whole thing off. Yeah. And then out there, well, where's the bait going to go? They will like yeah, the current. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Oh, that's awesome, mate. So you down here most days, are you? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. You spend the whole day, or just a couple of hours, or? Yeah. Well, I'm going to spend the whole day down here, especially with the bait coming up. Yeah. Do you ever have days where you get none? Uh, no, you get, you get a good feed going home. Yeah, yeah, it's good, yeah, eh? Yeah. That's awesome. Oh, that's great, mate. Thanks for chatting to us. Yeah, no, good as gold. And you have a great day, mate. You have a yeah. great day. Enjoy right. your white bait. Yeah, I will. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Yeah, thank you. Well, there you go, my friends. We've even got some secret sauce on how to catch white bait and where to position your net. So that, that was pretty awesome. So even the kayakers want to know if there's any white bait going. That's how scarce it is, guys. Hey, mate, are there any more white baiters down this way? Yep. On this side of the river or your side? Uh, by the bridge. By the bridge? Yep. So, guys, that's just a little taste of one of the most expensive delicacies that you can buy here in New Zealand. And you can catch it right in the red zone of Christchurch. Absolutely unbelievable. Anyway, guys, same as usual. If you like my videos, remember to subscribe and drop me a like and drop me a comment. Come say good day in the comments below if you want to know anything about white baiting or anything like that. And check either side up there, guys, and I'll put a couple of videos up there for you to have a look at. See you later. Bye.